Now, um, what what made you decide that you wanted to come to Wheaton? I chose Wheaton because, well, I really, I wasn't sure that I was going to come here at first, but then I visited and just the people made all the difference in the world. Uh, I like the, just the Christian atmosphere of the campus and just everything about it, it's great. It was my dream school and when I came I loved it as much as I thought I was going to. So I came back and here I am. I heard they had a good program for my major, Applied Health Sciences, and I heard really good things from my friends that went here. Um, I actually got, went through a period where I hated the school and didn't want to come, and so it was like just towards the end of senior year that it's like, you know what, it has everything that I wanted, so let's do it. Um, pretty much all my life, I'm a fourth generation weedy, so it's, it's just a dream come true to finally come here and attend college. And just the people around here, uh, very genuine, very true, and that really attracted me to this place because the students are all very, like, very comfortable with themselves and who they are in Christ and stuff like that. And that really is key. I like it a lot. Um. The fact that uh, they have a tennis team, that we can play tennis here, and that uh, there's a bunch of good guys. I met a bunch of good guys in the tennis team, and uh, they've got a lot of good programs, like uh, the philosophy and history programs and stuff. That's what I want to study. So, I heard about it trying to just find um, good, strong Christian colleges, but that also had really strong academics, and Wheaton really stood out in that sense, because it definitely has a strong academic record, too. So, um, I think the general atmosphere, it's really different from anywhere else. Um, the, just the community that I see, I saw just coming visiting one day. Um, honestly, academics. <laughs> I really am excited about the classes. Uh, well, I really liked the atmosphere when I visited, and uh, it's a Christian college, and I felt like uh, it would be a good place to learn in a uh, friendly building up environment, I guess, and uh, just it had really good academics. and like the setting, so. I like the Christian community and I want to wrestle, so it just seemed like a good fit. I'm excited about, I've grown up by myself at home. I have older siblings, but they never lived in the house. And so I'm excited a lot about the community, um, which I know everyone says, but um, I don't know, there's just a feeling here that you don't get many other places. Um, and, you know, largely it has to do with the bond of Christ. But um, on another note, I'm also very excited about just getting to study what you love and getting to um, really kind of investigate the passions Christ has given you and see where that's going to take you. I have friends here from New York that came home and raved about it and then I came and visited and the people were just incredible. Like everyone was so welcoming and I felt right at home and I love how it's like a Christian community and you can still get your education but integrate it with your faith and that's why I wanted to come. But I just decided because of the conservatory, I'm a piano, piano major, so that was the main reason for coming. When I visited the campus and got to stay on the floor of Traber 7 with all the guys, I knew this was the place for me. I was trying to decide between a school that was 30,000 kids and very liberal and Wheaton just seemed more like home, so. I've experienced the campus. There's a really great Christian atmosphere. I really enjoy that. I'm in the math field, the math department. There's some great teachers. It's a, uh, you know, they're, you really connect with the students. You know, it's the smaller classes. Really, this is the only school I applied to because I wanted to play baseball here, so. I came to Wheaton because I came from an area that didn't have a huge Christian community and so to be here seemed like a real blessing and a real gift and I actually accepted before I even came to the school um, and I committed before I even saw the school but once I was here it felt like home and it felt like God really wanted me to be here just so that I could learn more about him and learn more about the world around me and as cliches it sounds I think that it really holds a lot of truth. 
Well, actually, it was just up until the day I had to decide that I decided I wanted to go to Wheaton. Um, and what really changed my mind was uh, just seeing the community of Christian believers here um, influence me. College is about like what you're, who you're spending your time with, and who can like help you and lead you spiritually, and that's what we can provide. Uh, what piece of advice do you have for incoming freshmen? If I had one piece of advice, it would probably be, uh, this is a liberal arts school. It's not a trade school. So if you are going to major in something, don't do something that you think others would like or that might get you a job, because really your major doesn't correlate with what you end up doing in life. You know, your major should be something that you enjoy and that you like doing. So that would be my advice. Just learn for the sake of learning, not for, to appease someone else. Um, I think I'd just say uh, be sure to get a balance between academics and friends. I mean, you're at college for school, but it's great to, like, getting to know people, especially on your floor here. There are three things that, you know, make up Wheaton. You've got the social life, um, classes, and sleep. You can only do two of them well. Hi, I'm Professor Samuelson. I teach drawing. I encourage everybody to consider taking a drawing class. Is that valid advice? Absolutely. Um, freshman, I have a message for you. Things will be okay. You are okay. It's good that you're here. Relax a little bit. Um, I think that's it. Um, try something new. Um, coming from high school, you might have like an idea of like what you're good at, what you've done before, and you won't, might want to try to find the same thing. But it's really, really cool, especially in your four years, you know, to try something different. Join a club that you may not have been interested in before. Um, go to an event um, that with a group of friends or something that maybe is not your thing, but just try something new. You never know what you're going to find out is like really cool to you, something you, that you could become really passionate about. See you in chapel. Yeah. I need to take my mustache a little bit. Let's do it. There you go. Okay, we're good. Are you guys freshmen? No, you're a professor.